Yo! What's up, guys? It's me, your boy, B. Back here on the YouTube channel. We're in the big screen, guys. As you guys can tell, you know, we're in the big screen today. And that's because if you read the flipping title, we're going to be playing some Final Fantasy 15. A little bit drunk today, guys. All right? So, first of all, this... <coughs> Discla excuse me, disclaimer, all right? If you are not of legal drinking age, don't drink, all right? Don't drink and drive. Only drink responsibly, all right, guys? And if you are of the age, all right? I am of the age, way past the age, so your boy's drinking. All right, so we're going to play... We're going to play Final Fantasy XV a little bit drunk. So let's just, you know... Let's just relax today, guys. So I have myself a nice little glass here. And we have a couple things on the menu, my friends. Oh, before we start the stream. I mean, not the stream. Before we start the video. Sorry, guys. My camera went out of focus. But um, before we start, guys, if you guys could please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Comment down below or chat in the premiere. Uh, for those of you guys who already do that, thank you guys so much. Appreciate you guys a bunch. Um, but yeah, I guess without further ado, let's go ahead finally now and look at what is on today's menu for getting Shwasted. Alright, well, we're not gonna be getting like wasted, but like, you know, we're gonna be, we're gonna be feeling something, alright? We're gonna definitely be feeling something, especially, you know, um, after you guys find out how I'm going to be consuming these beverages, alright? So we're just gonna go ahead and pop the popper open, alright? We're gonna go ahead and pop her open. You see this? <laughs> Glass Coors. But guess what, guys? But guess what, guys? It's not over. Because we have my friend. Oh! Oh, uh, uh, Charles, are you here? Charles? Huh? Charles? So we got Charles here. We got Charles, alright. Because you, you know we gotta get a little devious with it, alright? We gotta do a little mixing of the drinkage. Drinkages. Ooh. Um. Mm, you know what? I don't wanna- I don't wanna mislead you guys with the title, alright? So we're gonna be getting a little bit of fadedness happening right now. Let's pour a little bit more. Woo! Okay. That's that. And... Um, you know, there was a little bit of an edit there. Basically, I poured some of the wine back in the bottle. No, I'm just kidding. It's all in here, baby. So, I mean, this is a pretty tall glass. It's as big as my face. So, I mean, you know, we got we got some we got some things going on. And then we got so we got the wine, we got the cores. Boom. We mix. We mix. So you guys seeing this? You seeing this, baby? All right, now I'm going to do something stupid. In about five seconds, all right, we're gonna be doing something absolutely bonkers. In about five seconds, all right. So here we go. All right, cheers! Boom. I'm a pussy. I'm a pussy. I didn't finish it, guys. Guys, I don't be like drinking like some of you freaking warriors and freaking champions out there at the bars every night, alright? <clears throat> but let's try to do it again. So, we're chugging this, by the way. Well, mm, I guess you wouldn't call it a chug anymore because. It's, we kind of stop, but let's do it again. Mini chug? Mini chug? Chug drugs? Chug drugs? We're drinking the chug drugs, alright? We're, get, we're getting our shields back up. Cheers. If you guys have a drink, and you guys have the legal drinking age, join me, my friends. Cheers!
<coughs> what if I just... What if I just puked on stream, guys? Or puked on camera? That would be horrible. Oh, I don't- I barely take my glasses off for you guys. So here's me without my glasses. If anyone cares. But they're going back on because I am legally 100% blind and it's kind of like reflection off of my glasses so you can't really see my eyes so my bad. Now you kind of can. Alright. So, first beer. Down. It's in the hatch. I don't know why I just did that, but... <laughs> oh, sorry guys, I just burped hella. Oh, alright, there's like a, like a tiny little bit left. There's nothing in here, guys, but it's just like a tiny bit. Okay. So, one beer, you know, it's not gonna do it for me, you know? It's not gonna do it for me. We did get a, you know, a pretty big, pretty decent sized shot of wine in there. So, you know what we're gonna do, guys? We're not stopping, all right? This is the B Variety Frat House, all right? Look at me. If you're washing and drinking, don't put that damn drink down, you pussy. Get it back in your hands. Pour it up again, damn it! Uh -huh. So here we go. You guys are officially being inducted. If you guys are drinking with me, you guys are officially being inducted in the B Variety Fraternity. Oh, well, hold on. What the hell? This ain't no B variety fraternity right here. My, hold on, I'm slacking, bro. This one's the B variety fraternity shot right here. There we go. All right. So we're just gonna do a little straight shot skis of wine skis, and we're just gonna get a little bel belligerent, my friends. Right. Cheers. Hold on, my focus. I am. Cheers! Alright, um, well, what are we gonna cheers to? I guess we'll cheers to long life, and hopefully we don't get destroyed by a asteroid. Cheers! <laughs> Now, wine, not as strong as like a shot, so it's pretty smooth, pretty smooth. And this is a smooth wine, this is more of like a cooking wine, kind of. I mean, you can't drink it, but well, I use it for cooking, but I'm just like using it now because I don't, I don't think I have anything. I think it's like a Merlot I have, a Merlot, you know, but I don't think it's open. Oh, I, f I forgot to show you guys what the next one is. So. First one, we had a coarse light. Uh, what percent alcohol is this? <laughs> she gripping all of my balls. I got the mood, tell you shit. This is 4.2% alcohol. And here, my friends, we have Hazy Little Thing IPA. Ooh, look at this. And this one, I believe, is 6.7%. Sierra Nevada. Hazy Little Thing IPA, family owned, operated, and argued over. Okay, so they got a little sense of humor here. All right, looks like maybe the, you know, the people at Sierra Nevada, um, maybe not seeing eye to eye, maybe. I don't know, it says on the label right here, family owned, operated, and argued over, so, I don't know. But this is a 6.7% alcohol, it is a IPA. What is it, Irish Pale Ale, I think that's what it's called. So this is a Irish style beer. These are more stronger. Irish people are known to um, be very, you know, big into drinking, as well as Russians too. I heard Russians are, you know, real big drinkers, um, as well as Koreans too. Koreans, I'm Korean by the way. Koreans are known to drink a lot in Korea, you know. So, and some of the Koreans in America too. 
Uh, but you know this this that that last wine shot, you know, it, it wasn't really feeling making me, you know, get crazy. So well, I don't really get crazy when I'm drunk. I kind of just like get actually I kind of do. But yeah, so you know, let, let's go a little bit more because I don't want to mix wine with the IPA. Mixing wine with the Coors Light is okay because they're both like kind of similar flavor profile and they're like both light. But this IPA, I think it's gonna be dark. So I don't want to, you know, mix it. So let's take it before. Let's take the wine shot before. All right. So if you guys are drinking, pour up another whatever you got. All right. Pour up a one. Pour up another whatever you got. I'm already slurring up my words more than I usually do. So you already know it's about to be a good ass video, guys. All right. Hit the like, hit the sub if you're drinking, alright? Drink it with me. And comment down below if you're drinking. Or, you know, if... And obviously, guys, you know, I put a disclaimer out there. Don't underage drink. That shit is not good. Don't do that. Don't drink and drive. Don't do none of that shit, alright? I'm here in the home. You see it? And we're drinking. Oh, I'm not in focus. <clears throat> and hopefully, I think the Final Fantasy music is playing in the background, so I don't have to add music. So it should be okay. All right, so if you want to get, if you want to join the B variety, the B fraternity, Sigma B, Alpha B fraternity, Alpha B, take this shot. All right, cheers to, um, just hopefully more world peace. Cause I mean, dude, the news, the news, the past five, six years has been straight dog shit, bro. Like so much horrible things that I'm hearing about and it's like dude what the heck is going on you know so peace all right cheers to peace cheers to peace all right and we're gonna we're gonna do some more chugging all right we're gonna do some more chug jugging we gotta get our shields up all right we gotta get our shields up ah uh. Oh yeah. Ooh, okay, that was good. Here, it's right here. I I'm, I'm I gotta edit stuff out, but I finished it. And just um, just so we can make this a little bit more interesting. Oh my God, it's 14 minutes into the drinking, and and we're not even almost done yet. So let's do this a little more interesting. You don't have to take the shot. And I'm only taking wine, by the way. So I would not be doing this as like a uh, like a liquor or something like that. You know, and I'll be done. I'd be done. Nah, nah, that's too little, man. What the heck? All right, that's fine. This is the last wine shot. So we did three wine shots, but well, we did four because we mixed one with the um. We mixed one with the coarse light. So here we go. The last one. I'm gonna just do this one. You don't have to do it. Okay, that's good. All right, so now we have our hazy little thing IPA. Let's go ahead and pour this bad boy up in here. Oh, this kind of has a light color to it as well. But I don't like to mix the wine with the IPA because it's like just going to ruin the flavor profile of the IPA. You know? Even though this guy is going down the hatch, if you, if you, you know what I'm saying? All right, if you catch my vibe. I might have to snag up another core skis for you guys. I might have to go downstairs. Because I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. And there are crabs. Alright. Look at this thing. Beautiful color. It doesn't... It, the color doesn't look as good on my camera. But it has a beautiful orange color. Orangish yellow color. Got a nice foam on top. Alright, um, what are we cheersing to? Cheers to the YouTube channel and to all my supporters and people who mess with your boy. Cheers to all of you guys, alright? This one's for you. This one's going down the hatch for you guys, okay? Cheers. Sorry, this one's gonna be a little bit harder because it's an IPA, alright? So chugging this might be, eh, not, not the best. I like... I like slowly drinking IPAs because they taste good, you know. But we're gonna chug this one because fuck it. Mm. 
failure. <clears throat> I'm a failure. I'm a failure to society. Nah. It's fine. It's fine. We're chilling. <clears throat> this is good. I might go down <clears throat> and snag up another another core skis as we continue playing. But I think we're good. Because we're like 18 minutes in. We're like 18 minutes into the video. Let's just start this shit. Because I'm already fucking buzzed. Excuse my language. And I'm ready to get down. Alright guys, sorry. I had a burp like so bad. I had a burp like none other. I was burping for like 5 minutes straight. Oh wow, the background turned light all of a sudden. It's crazy. Oh yeah, I'm feeling it for sure. I'm not like drunk, you know what I'm saying? It takes more than that to get me drunk, alright? But your boy is feeling something. So let's recap last video, alright? We're I'm still trying to I'm still gonna try to be as professional as possible. So in the last video, we delivered some goods to a motel, which was the motel in Long With Rest Area. I think it's called Long With, right? We did it for Cindy. Um, it's pretty much just side quest stuff. Um, we are follow still following the main quest, but it's not main quest enough because we are so early in the game that it's, you know, it's kind of like a main quest side quest kind of thing. So the next quest that we're going to be doing, though, however, is going to be a pretty big quest. I feel like we're going to be going to the golden. Oh, it's right there. there or not the golden, the Galden Quay. We're going to be going to the Galden Quay, and we're going to be um, setting off to go find Lady Lunafreya and meet up with her and get this wedding underway. So that's what we're doing. We're here in Laid right here, as you guys can see. Looking a little bit like North America, kind of a little bit, right? Kind of looking like Texas right here. There's no peninsula for Florida, though. But we got like the East Coast, the West Coast, but... <sighs> Um, before we do that though guys, I said in the last video, hey, let's, you know, fully explore everything that Laid has to offer. So we're gonna go up here in this, uh, upper area, and we have a side quest over here from Dave. That we're gonna, you know, go ahead and, uh, do. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys are ready. Uh, it's gonna, we're gonna make this one a longer video because I'm drunk-ish. So, you know, I, I don't want to waste the drunk. We're just gonna, you know, we're just gonna have a grand old time, you know. Uh, it, this might be a long video, guys, so just heads up. Alright, so here we are. Let's go, guys. So, I think we're gonna start off by... Oh, what's this? We have a new little thing for time quests. What's this? Cactar, eh? It is near Knush Cherry. View detailed information about the time quest. Okay. I don't know. I don't freaking know. All right, let's just go. Let's just go. So let's go ahead and head. Let's go ahead and you know, hang out with Dave. We're gonna go pick up some side quests. All right, guys. Dude, why don't it let me do manual? Why doesn't it let me do manual? No, no, not this one. Map point. Why doesn't it let me do manual? Uh, so what we're gonna do, guys, <clears throat> we're gonna go ahead and go to Palabram Haven, and in order. we're gonna, yeah. uh, right. take a little bit of a walking journey up to Dave. We're not gonna take the car, because it's not fun doing that stuff, you know, you wanna, you don't wanna, like, when you're playing, where are we going? Oh, we're going on the off-road. But, you know, when we're playing the game, you don't want to just, like, you know, AFK. You want to go out there, play the game, and we're going to go um, from that campsite. We're going to walk up to Dave. All right, and then maybe we can find some monsters, maybe some side quests. And it's going to be a good time, guys. It's going to be a good time. Do we got some musics going on? Under Siege? Yo, chill. I'm not trying to be under Siege right now. I'm trying to be chilling. I forgot I have my beer with me. I'm feeling a little... I'm feeling the alcohol for sure, skis. For sure, skis, my friends. Okay. So, you know, we just had a nice little drinking video. And we're just hanging... We're just having a boys' night out. You know what I'm saying? 
We're having a guy's night out, no ditty, all right? We're having a guy's night out, no ditty, you know what I'm saying? And we're just gonna go whoop some fiends, some daemons, you know? It's gonna be a great time. Oh, we're parking, we're we parking right here, uh, Ignis. We're parking right here, Ignis. All right, boys, let's go. So here we are, we're in lead right now. And we're just exploring. <laughs> so we got some things. We got some food spots. All we have to do, guys. <laughs> oh god, I'm so burnt because of the, all the alcohol. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. All we gotta do is just keep walking up. We just gotta keep walking up. Can we manually drive? I literally just said... <coughs> I literally just said we're gonna walk it up. But I was like, nah, screw it. Screw it. Let's go there. Let's Everything start at the... Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I'm goofing up already. Let's start at the, um... Oh, uh, dude, I can't talk right now. Let's start at the... What is that thing? The, the, um... The consumables. The freaking... The, the fucking... The fucking miscellaneous items, bro. Let's start here. Taking a walk on the wild side? Nothing yeah, like yeah, let's, par let's park it here. Nowhere. God, I'm, I'm fucking drunk. I'm not drunk, guys, but, you know... We're feeling. I'm feeling something. Yeah, these things, the freaking supplies or whatever. Let's stop it. Let's start it here. All right. So it looks like we're like at some sort of like power plant, an abandoned power plant. It looks like everything here is fucking abandoned, man. Like there ain't nobody here. I mean, there were some people at the abandoned shack, but it's like they were just like pass buyers, you know? Who is this? Keep your distance or die. Vicious varmints and dangerous demons. Yo, chill. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Alright, so here we'll start our journey, my friends. Here we shall start our journey. So what we're going to do is we're, we just got to go straight up. We got to go straight up and we got to go talk to Dave. So let's go do that. Let me go ahead and get the um, ingredient that's here. Hopefully we can find some enemies here. Who? Yeah, that wasn't my imagination. We got another guy tired of running. Find the person in distress. Where they at though? Where they at though? Why can't we jump on this? Come on, man. Where is this a hole? Please, somebody help! Can you hear his ass. He's like, ah. Please, somebody help. Freaking sorry ass. I mean, get your freaking. Pick up a stick, man. Pick up the Glocky, bro. Where is this guy? Oh, he's in here. Here we go. What up, bro? You need help? Use a potion? Yes. Thank you so much. No oh, problem. Day's work. Oh, we got a little uh, achievement. Completed five side quests. Nice. Alright. That was it. Okay. Not gonna lie, um, I would have liked to see maybe just a little bit of, you know, a little bit of life to that guy. It just felt like it was a, it was quite oh, simply like a quest. You know, it didn't feel like I was like it didn't feel like um a real life interaction. It quite literally felt like a quest that I was doing. It was like, you know, there was no dialogue between the guy in distress and Noctis. It was just simply, oh, we found you, use a potion, we finish it, you know? And I'm not the biggest fan of those kind of like, you know, mundane, kind of like, not really impactful quests where it just seems where it's just like kind of like a grind kind of thing. But it is a big game, it's a long game, you need things to do to level up, so I get it that maybe Square Enix didn't invest a lot of money and resources into the dialogue for these missing peoples, or these peoples in distress. 
But I would have liked to see just a little bit of dialogue, like, Oh, thank you so much for helping me, or like, Oh my god, I got attacked by some demons earlier, watch out, or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, but instead, we get, you know, just nothing. Just, here's your level up, blah, blah, blah. Um, how do I, how come it does not let me manually drive the car? I gotta Google this. Alright, uh, I don't know if we can manually do it. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. But, um, let's just keep walking. I googled it. It said until you get to chapter 3, you can start manually driving. Man, it's hot. Then lose the jacket. Then lose the jacket. I've heard that dialogue so many times. Come on. Okay, where are the enemies? I'm trying to fight some things. I'm trying to whoop some guy's ass real quick. Uh, we're getting closer to Dave. We're getting closer to Dave. You know what? I'm just gonna drive my car because I didn't realize how big this freaking map is. So we're just gonna drive the whip to Dave. Alright. I was saying all this, all this stuff earlier. Saying, hey man, we're gonna, you know, explore the world. Find these side quests. I mean, I'll do drunk for that shit right now, man. Someone take me some, man. Where the Uber? I someone called the Uber, bro. Someone called the Uber. There we go. Auto sprint. We're auto sprinting. Thank God for auto sprint. <laughs> so yeah, let's just take the car to Dave, cause I mean, eh, screw it, man. And this area seems to be not too heavily infested with fiends oh, nice or demons or whatever. So we're not even fighting anything. It's nothing happening right now. So let's just take the whip. Let's go to Dave. Maybe he'll send us on some missions to go whoop some demons ass. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we're tired. We're tired. We gotta take a little. We gotta take a little breath. All right, we're good. Oh, what do we got here? What's this? Iron shavings? Probably going to use it for like, what? Probably gonna... Probably gonna use it for like crafting or some shit. All right, thank God for the regalia, dude. Thank God for the regalia. Map point. Set as a destination. Set as destination. There we go. Alright, freaking A, man. Because I didn't realize it was going to be this long, man. Of a, of a walk. You know? Oh, okay. We got some, like, some Bollywood vibes. Shout out to all my Muslims for Eid Mubarak. For those who celebrate, my neighbors celebrate Eid Mubarak literally like five feet away from me, my neighbors, you know? So, I gotta give a shout out. We gotta give a shout out because, you know, I see the culture, I see it literally right in front of me. So, you know, I'm Korean, obviously. I don't, I don't celebrate that, but. My neighbors do, so I gotta, you know, I fuck with my neighbors, you know, so shout out to uh, anyone who celebrates Eid and Mubarak. Shout out to any- I'm getting drunk, I'm feeling drunk, guys. Woo! Okay, here we go, this is nice. Norduskian Blockade. Man, what is this guy doing? Ignis, I mean, Prompto. Put your damn seatbelt on, Prompto. God damn, we freaking driving in the freaking Rocky Mountains, man. You better freaking, you better fly out the car. We got the roof down. We got the freaking top down. <laughs> All right, screw this music. <laughs> We're here. It is quite comforting to see other people about. Okay, here we are. Uh, so we're in some sort of like city. <laughs> City. I'm, I'm high, dude. I'm not. I'm, I'm drunk. We're in some sort of like abandoned, like you know, auto shop. 
looks a little, I mean, it's not abandoned, but it looks beat down. We got some beat down ass at auto shop, you know what I'm saying? So, and we got some homies here. Who's this? Out of order? The hell? Alright, so we gotta find Dave. Where's Dave's bitch ass? Excuse my language, I'm drunk. Here's Dave. We got a quest. You sticking around these parts for a spell? I could use your help digging up some dog tags. Oh, more dog tags, huh? So we're going to go get some dead hunters, you know, items, bro. That's sketch. That's sketch. Where is that, though? Oh, I see it. All right, so here we go. We got our first quest. We got our first side quest. But let's go ahead and explore, um, what is this called? Prairie Outpost. Let's fully explore Prairie Outpost. And, um, let's see what this has to offer. We could play darts? Huh? Throw the dart with left click when Noctis moves his hand forward. Focus and aim for the bullseye. How to focus aim? The hell? This thing sucks. Yeah, I got it. Like, so we have to aim down. Oh, we were close there. Look at that. We gotta hit the bullseye though. It's like right here. Ah, Shiva. What's up with the, what's up with the, why does it look so weird? Yeah. Oh, we got it. Oh, oh, we get AP for that. Yo. Okay. Oh, and, um, um, Prompto took us, he snagged a little flick, I think. Oh, so close. I think you can just keep farming AP, but man, this is boring as hell. No, we're, we're playing the game. I want to whoop someone's dude. I want to whoop some fiend's ass, bro. All right, hold on. Let, let's let's explore everything. Monster tracking device pause off. Let's explore everything in the prairie outpost. It looks like this is a place just for hunters to be chilling out. There's a shop here. Maybe this guy gives in us some quests. Maybe. Take a look at our wares. Hey, nope, no again. quests. Anyone over here besides Dave giving out quests? Maybe this guy over here with his sweet little car. Oh, it's a lady. How are you today? Oh, she's a shopkeep lady. Uh, Until next time. We'll pass. Okay. Um. All right, let's start doing quests. Let's go ahead and look for the dog tag. We gotta go over there. And How are you today? What the? Bye now. Let's go ahead and do it, guys. Hopefully, we can run into some enemies. I'm trying to fight something, dude. I want some action. Let's hit it. All right. I want some action. Lepolith Haven. So we found another campground. Inventory full. Uh oh. All right. Let's go ahead. We'll set up a camp here. Yeah. I'm all sticky and gross. We got an AP. Nice. Um, you know what? Um, Ignis, we cooked the spicy long bone rib steak last time. Let's go ahead and get some cheese pizza, shall we? I'm in the mood for some cheese pizza. Sheesh! You got that margarita kind of vibe? <clears throat> Yo, that's, that looks delicious. <clears throat> oh, it's nighttime though. Skill level up? Oh, I should have. I, I actually skipped past that. Whoops. Nice shot. We got some Proto. pictures. Man, what kind of shot is this? What do you mean, nice shot? This dude's legs. Small legs. Oh, okay. Oh, this one's good. This one's good. I like that one. Now that's what I call a good shot. Oh, no ditty right here. Look at this. No ditty right here. You see that shit? No ditty. You see that shit? <sighs> Peaceful out here. Or is it nighttime? Well, it's not nighttime. So much okay. Hidden by loud city lights. That's all well and good, 
but I'm more concerned about the things hiding in the dark. Well, it's definitely no place for a moonlight stroll. But it's not all bad. She gripping yeah, up on my ball. Like, I had a never moon would have guessed. Shit. Why not? Now, what the fuck does this me inventory for? Sorry, guys. I'm getting more like real me. I'm cursing and all that stuff. Why does this say inventory full, though? Oh, we gotta use it. The fuck? Um, I thought we just like do this and it makes a flask. I don't know. If I can... I don't know. I don't know how to do that. Is you're a prince? What? Princes can't enjoy the outdoors? She gripping all of my balls. I had to move type shit. Okay, like, I get it. My inventory's full, but like... Hello? Oh, we need to buy flasks. I think that's what it means. Alright, let's look for the dog tag. Clearly gonna be finding some enemies here. That's what I'm hoping. Cause like, man, it's getting kind of boring right now. I'm trying to whoop someone's ass right now. Man, fuck this passive shit. We're trying to fuck someone. We're trying to fuck someone up right now. We're trying to fuck somebody up. No diddy. We're getting to the action. Oh, there we go. We seen some enemies. Seen oh, some some giraffes. Yeah. Is that an enemy though? Okay, yeah, we got some enemies. Oh no, these guys are not hostile, right? We're outnumbered. I propose we take them out one by one. Oh, these guys are hostile. Okay, here we go. Ow, this guy hit me. Whose side are you on? Sorry. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Yeah. Big All parry, boom, blink strike, there we go. Big stuff there. Let's blink strike him, or warp strike him, I mean. Oh shoot, we got hit by that. Big parry. Camera angle was like, like why is it so far out? It's cause this stupid freaking bird, right? And I need to get this bird out of here. Right back at ya. Gotta love it. It's that bird was fucking up the angle. There we go. Now we got a better angle here. Oh, we're stasis. Uh, it doesn't matter. We can finish him without having mana. I forgot to switch my weapon. Okay, there we go. Maybe it's just me. But I felt kind of bad taking those things down. You're not alone. But out in the wild, it's kill or be killed. And personally, I prefer the former. Oh, here's cover, right here. We can cover. Let's get our mana back. Okay, there we go. That's what I was looking for. I was looking for some action, man. I'm tired of freaking talking to people. Let's go get some freaking... I'm trying to whoop someone's ass. Alright, we gotta find the dog tag, the doge tags. Oh, here it is. Glad we found the it. doge tag. Time to make another delivery. Okay. So, I think that's it. She gripping all of my balls, I had to move type shit. Let's go back to the rest point. Thankfully, we set up that camp spot, that's good. <clears throat> so we can just easy access to Dave. What up, Dave? We came back, we killed some giraffes. I got you, your, your dog tag. The hunter can be put to rest now. Oh, no, no, no. Y'all done good. Whoever owned that tag's probably breathing a sigh of relief right about now. What do you mean? I thought he was dead. I thought they're dead. I don't know. Oh, we got five mega potions. Nice. Okay, was that it for this area? Was that it? That can't be it, right? Let's see if Dave has anything else to say. 
Howdy. Where are y'all headed today? Uh, for a side Keep quest. Hard at it. Okay, it looks like he's actually done with the side quest. Okay, um, so what we're gonna do here is... So we are going to... Get in our car. We're gonna set up a map point so we can auto-drive, because yeah, we can't manually drive. Um, uh, let's do it. Let me zoom in. Right here. Let's set that as our destination. Everything in order. Um, yep. I want right. to see what that that like big building is. Maybe there's some quests there. Maybe there's some things, some enemies. I don't know. I mean, I turn this trash off, man. We're here. I just like the you know the silent piece of the you know the nature. Oh man. <clears throat> Okay, so lead is okay. Not really a lot going on in lead, though. I will say that. It should um, be a nice change of pace. With confidence, though. Not really a lot of story. Not really a lot of, you know, energy here. The only sort of energy we got was from Hammerhead. Along with, which simply just like felt like a place to just, you know. Harbor NPCs as opposed to like really be like a living breathing thing, you know what I'm saying? Um, which was pretty disappointing. I would have liked for the starting zone to maybe have a little bit more interactability within the um, within the NPCs. Because everything just feels like, you know, no, nice it's, here. Yeah. it has no purpose. It just feels like it's simply for, well, I guess it does have a purpose, but every quest here just feels like it's just to the gain exp on. experience points, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. As opposed to, like, really trying to build a story, you know? No use hanging around here. No Indeed. use hanging around here? What's this? So we do- we did f exp find the area here, but it's locked off. But yeah, that that is one criticism I have for this area. Um... There's no direction for this dire this area. It's just simply just get out. That's the story for lead. The story for lead is get out. We gotta go to Galden Quay, you know? Um, doesn't really give you... It doesn't really... Um... Reward the player for exploring the... You know, ins and, ins and outs of all of these places. Which I would've liked a little bit better. Come on, why is... And the auto run function is... Auto run function is weird. There we go. Not now it's working, but it wasn't working <laughs> earlier. So I, I will say that's a pretty big disappointment. Like the side quests have no lore. There really is not much lore here in lead. Um, it, it's not looking. It's not looking enticing, you know? We do have this whole area, but like, what's here? Wait, hold on. Um, let's set the destination. Yeah, let's go there. So, we're not giving up yet though. Uh, we're gonna still be fully exploring lead, um, but I will say it is pretty disappointing. None of the side quests have any sort of emotional attachment towards them. It's just simply to level up, um, and that, that's a big problem. It's a it's a big problem, especially for your starting zone. Like it's the starting zone, man. You know, like it's got to be the most impactful. It's like the introduction to the song. It's like the introduction to the album. The intro to the album can't be ass, or else then people are gonna click off. You know, and I will say that lead is pretty. It's pretty lackluster. It's it's like they didn't really hey, too much, much care going. into this place. At least before the Errand Prince quest. 
you know? Before we go to Galden Quay, there's not really much to really, you know, go around. Oh, here we go. Let's fight these guys, because I'm bored. Ready for this? Allows. Count on it. Big carry. Nice, we got one AP. Here I am. Oh, we couldn't block there. Oh, big link strike actually. Did we get a link strike? Oh shoot, we got hit by that. Oh, we gotta we gotta kill the big guy first. Uh screw this. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Good link strike here. Let's deal with the big guys first. Nice. Gladio got a big hit off of him. Big parry. I just want to fight some things, man. I'm bored right now, you know what I'm saying? Let's, let's get some MP back. Kill the calf. Warp strike again. Thank you. You too. You as well. Let's finish him up with the mass immunity. Oh, this guy's a little bit stronger. Let's finish him off with the mass immunity. Blindside link, nice. Oh, let's switch up the weapons. Let's switch up the weapons. Don't do anything. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I want to see more of this. It's a lot of just like driving around doing nothing. Um. Okay, so we're going to walk up here. I just have a feeling that there's gonna be nothing there though, and it's being blocked by like walls and shit. So, wait, where's our car? Why did we park here? Where's our car at? Um. Alright, I don't know where our car is at, but this is looking like something that is going to be good. This is looking like something that's going to be good. Yeah, this is what I want. I want to fight some people. I'm tired of just like... I'm just driving the whip. Let's go fight some things. Let's go get some action going. And yeah, so we got this little left side here. Let's check out this left side. We got an enemy here. There we go. Wanna bash some heads in? You know what? Oh man. We strike up to him. Or whoop strike up to him. The Prince of Pain. Yep. Oh, and that's it. Okay. Probably gonna be some sort of treasure here. Oh, we got some sort of like architecture like here. Fun. Let's get some uh, mana back. We need more mana. Alright, here we go. Nice. Get some aerial combos on him. That's cool. Get our mana back. Okay, we can't get our mana back. All right, let's, let's. Can we do it on stasis? You need to be like covered behind somebody. All right, what's this? Okay, we're exploring, guys. You seen this? Tomb of the Wise, Royal Tomb. The door is locked. All right, you know what? I I literally hate this game already. So we explore and we're just not rewarded. It's just like, hey, this place is locked. What? Beautiful. Man, get this fucking. Um, excuse my language. I'm a little bit drunk. I guess we just have to do the main quest because there's not really much going on here. Like, yeah, like we got that whatever. We got that one side quest from Dave, but like, bro, that was it. So, screw it. Let's just do the Aaron Prince. Because... 
There's nothing. I don't even know what we're doing. All right, so we're gonna go. Uh, where was that again? Uh, oh yeah, we're gonna go to. Um, I set the fast travel over to the Solhand Pass, so we can go over there and we could hopefully something you know interesting will happen because right now not really anything interesting is going on. Just feels like. Um, I don't know. This doesn't feel very good, though, as a good starting zone. I mean, let me finish this drink. Cheers, guys. Cheers, I'm finishing it. Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Yeah? I cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace, nor the pride I take in my betrothal playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Oh, we've, we've already heard this before. My marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. Man, this shit sounds straight edge as fudge, dude. I don't know, if, like, I don't really care about this girl. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the like, coming days. Like, she just Please does not seem like, I mean, hopefully we get a little bit more look insight onto in the her and not this course. relationship. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. But um, and we're Nazi here, guys. Likes the idea. Solhand Pass. Um, is there uh, anything here? What's that? There's nothing here. I do. All right, l let's just go. Let's just go to Golden Quay. I don't even friggin' know. Let's just go to Golden Quay. Everything in order. Yep. All right. Um, because I I wanted to explore this area, but you can't go anywhere. It's freaking rocks everywhere. It's like the Thunder Plains in Duratar. Um, but yeah, I, I wish they. I don't know. I don't know what this game is doing right now. Um, I will say that you know. The starting zone is a little bit lackluster, though. Not gonna lie. It looks beautiful. It plays beautifully. But it could use a little bit more life in this place, you know? Within the NPCs. Hey! I see the sea! Within I maybe see random too. interactions. That's Golden Kinda wanna go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. Oh, look at Nobody that. Nobody goes to Golden for an island, though. They go to kick back and get massages. And say with the seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. Man, this should look like a fucking... This should look like a trap house in Hawaii, bro. They, si they sizing this shit up. This should look like this freaking trap house right now. Alright, but here we are, here we are, guys. We're finally doing the main quest. Jesus Louise, man. I was hoping a, there was a little bit more. Dang, yeah. he's reverse nice. para, reverse parking? But I was hoping there was gonna be a little bit more for lead. In terms of, like, the extra content. But, mm, not really. Damn, someone left their diary, but we're about to check it out. The fellow I helped down the mountain and I are on our way back to Lestalum. Least, I think that's where we're headed. Should only be a little further, but I feel like we're just going around in circles. Phyllis said we ought to take the road less traveled and follow the river. That the fish will keep our stomach filled. Stomachs filled. Sharpest attack, this one. Said he wants to be a journalist, but I reckon I ought to make him my partner. Is this a girl's diary or a guy's diary? Hold on. We got a new recipe for this shit? What, what the heck? Why am I in the sand now? Hey, so we got a seller yeah, here. No, we'll pass. Later. Where's the seafood? Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, they're talking about, like, oh, I heard the seafood is amazing here. What the hell? 
Why is my That's homie it. on the billboard? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> oh, can't this. wait to try it. It's taking a flick. <clears throat> Kenny and Kelly Crozet, only you can keep your nest safe. Talk to your little sister. Join the hunt today. Oh, we could do some tipster stuff. Okay. But yeah, these guys were sizing up this place. This thing looks like a rundown ass, fucking third world country ass motherfucking shit right here, bro. Some kind of hold up in Altitia. Oh yeah, guys. You mind if I butt in on the conversation here? Sorry to get a little bit close. I don't really understand personal boundaries Hello like that. Hello and welcome. Please come this again. This isn't even the tipster. What's this? Golden Quay, stunning seaside getaway situated along the Van Ath coast in southern Lade. Known not only for its world-class spa, but also for the exquisite seafood dishes crafted by Mother of Pearl's chef de cuisine, Coctura Arlun. But where's the restaurant? While the Quay currently enjoys its reputation as the kingdom's premier resort. Resort? Come on, Square Enix. You are marketing this as a resort? This shit look like a third world country, somebody's backyard, bro. Backyard in fucking Indonesia and some fucking jungles type shit. Where's the freaking big buildings? I guess this is laid, so it's not as technologically advanced. I don't know. Golden itself was once a quiet fishing town. That all changed when Niflheim made inroads into Lucian territory some 150 years ago. And I feel like you put all land outside the Crown City under Imperial Patrol. <laughs> Sorry, I had to burp. From that time onward, the former fishing village transformed into a trading post, connecting the Lucian continent with the Imperial province <laughs> of Accordo. Sorry guys, I'm burping so much. In time, the Empire shifting their, shifted their shipping operations from the sea to the skies, and Golden's importance was that as an Imperial outpost diminished. Wait, and Golden's importance as an Imperial outpost diminished. While well, the town lost its strategic value, however, it gained a culture gleaning heavily from Altishian immigrants down, drawn to Lucian shores. In that sense, one could say the Quay owes its current success to the Empire's intervention. What? So because Niflheim, aka the Empire, switched from tr uh, trading from sea to the skies, the importance of Galden's um, uh, diminished. But what they gained, or what they lost in business value, they gained in cultural value. Um, I don't fucking, man, get this... Where's the tipster, dude? Give me a quest. I want to fight some guys. So, they're marketing this place as a crazy resort. This shit look like fucking... This shit look like the city in Final Fantasy X. You know what I'm saying? In the beginning. I forgot what it was called. Um, but, I mean, the place looks nice. But it's like, this is a resort? Like, this, I mean, I don't know. Maybe they could have just done just like a little bit more. It looks nice Ready though. Don't get He's me wrong. My sea legs first. <laughs> Don't get <laughs> me wrong. Hurry. It I... does look good. But it's like they were hyping this thing up to be like Cancun or some shit. This shit look like the fucking backyard of some Indonesian fucking crack house. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Say so what the hell? Take a shot from here. Good call. Now it's picture time. Uh, let me get this shot. Oh, love the lighting. This should just remind me of like jungle Asia. Take a shot from here. You know what good I'm saying? Call. Now not the resort time. of Asia, not the good Ready part now. of Asia, but the jungle Asia. Oh, love you the know? lighting. Now that. Alright, let's go to that little whatever this thing is. That's where we're supposed to go. We gotta hop on the ferry. So that's our that's our next quest. We gotta hop on the ferry. We gotta get out of lead. So lead, I'm not gonna lie, a little disappointing. It really was. 
And that's not good because you are... This is the first zone that you're introducing your players to. You need to have something that's going to captivate them besides goddamn Cindy. You know what I'm saying? So... Welcome to Golden Key. Who the I'm hell is this freaky ass Edward Scissorhands oh, looking ass? Boots bring you here. Why is it so dark? What about him? Well, they'll not take you forth. And what's your story? I'm an impatient traveler. Who is this guy? Ready to turn ship. The ceasefire's getting us nowhere. Ceasefire? <laughs> Why is everything dark? What's this? Some sort of souvenir? <gasps> they make those? What? No. Consider it your allowance. Uh huh? Yeah. And who's allowing us? A man of no consequence. Oh, yeah, right. Taking thumb, taking thumbnails. Oh. The hell? How much shade is? What that guy how much goddamn shade is in this place? Well, I won't discount the possibility. I say we go check it out for ourselves. So we are now introduced to what seems to be some sort of an antagonist character. Um, he was talking about like. How the ceasefires are useless. He flung us a coin. Um, but not much in terms of explaining what this guy is, who he is, what is he talking about, you know. Winning snapshots of the fourth photo contest on display now. Theme Ignis, okay. Oh, wow, our homie's famous. Snapshot, oh, he won. Let's go, Ignis, let's go. You, you represented for the gang. Wait, what? Uh, what is this? I don't even know what this is. Oh, okay, my guy looking like he's like freaking Neo. Um, freaking, not the, not the movie, the, the, the artist. He's looking like Usher or some shit. Alright, screw this guy. <laughs> Okay, now everyone has their own little slideshow. Okay, all right, screw this. Yeah, get me. I don't have time for this. I see them every day. All right, we're seeing them every day. Let me turn up the um, audio real quick. The voice vo or the uh, master. So it's like forty-five. if you can afford it. How much are we talking? I'm not made of gills. Yeah, we're in some we're in some sort of like um. Welcome to the mother of pearl. Oh, it's the mother of pearl. What do you feel like like a di today? oh, it's a diner. So, oh, we can get some. We can get some cyclists. Finally, we can do something, bro. Oh wait, maybe. Oh, we clicked the wrong one. We need some hunts. I need some hunts. So here's the tipster. Ah, oh, yes. There we go. Finally, we got oh, some hunts going on. This is what I'm looking nasty. for, guys. I'm drunk as shit. I'm not trying to be like freaking like hearing people talking shit right now. It's like, your capable hands. Yeah, fuck, fuck that shit, bro. Excuse my language, but. F that ish, bro. I'm trying to fight much some more of the effers. Current bounty. Okay, that's a nighttime bounty. No, no, let's not wait yet. Alright, let's go ahead and take. Let's go ahead and do some bounties. So, what's the. What's our. What's our quest now? Now that we're we talked to that weird sketchy dude, um, the, the four friends arrive at Golden Quay only to find the dock is blocked. They search for an alternate means of sailing to Altice. Oh, it's blocked. Yeah, I need to turn up the volume just a little bit because I couldn't hear that dude talking. That with that like shadowy figure, mother effer. Let me do that, and then let me... Hold on. Alright, sorry guys. Alright, let's do some quests. We gotta kill some guys called Glamhoth. Where are they at, though? Let's go to Ruby Shears. Oh, okay, I see them on the map. Okay. Alright, so it's nighttime now, or it's approaching nighttime. Oh, look at these little jellyfish. That's cool. The auto run function is so weird. Okay, there we go. Yeah, 
Yeah, this introduction is very much reminding me of Final Fantasy X. When uh, Lady Yuna is, you know, performing the little passing thing or whatever it's called. I forgot what it's called. Um, yeah, it reminds me of that city. Was it? I forgot what. Ah, uh, I'm so bad at names. There's a place that we could sleep at. Let's not sleep yet. I want to go do some quests. Maybe we'll find some daemons that we could potentially kill. It's time, Gladio. Come on. Gotcha. Yeah, let's go. Finally, we can fight some motherfuckers. I'm trying to fight, bro. I'm not tired of this this poopy lore. Seems we found what we were looking for. Let's go ahead and warp strike. Let's send him like there. Oh shit, yo, I'm about I'm dead, I'm dead. Boy, what? What 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 what? Go for it! Big parry. There we go, we're daggering. Oh, oh, we're dead again? Oh, yo, these guys are tough, man. He's a big one. Oh, shit, yo, I'm dead again. Yo, okay, okay, this is not good. Um, these guys are very hard. Oh my god, I'm dead again. That's what you're hung up about. Okay, this is not looking good. Uh, let's use it. We have our last potion on Nox. Watch the enemy's movements. Don't. Yep. Right. Big carry. I need to get out of here. Let's go for this guy. I'm blocking, man. I'm blocking, man. My pleasure. Um, I'm confusion. Watch yourself, no. No. Big carry. I know, I know, I know. These guys are hard. Just, I'm just waiting for a parry. Oh, there we go. All of you guys use your damn abilities. Not Pronto, you're up. Nice work, Gladio. There we go. Ah, yo! Take a take a photo. What do you mean take a photo? No, 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 no. I go. Hopefully, we get good experience. I try to hard focus this guy. Maybe we could stun him out. Excuse me. Forgive her. Oh, Shiva. Alright, I, I think I, I think I gotta end this. I think we gotta we gotta like. Okay, Gladio's do. Okay, that's a big AOE right there. Can 
We can do this. I'm blocking, man. I'm blocking. We gotta chill. Is my team good? Holy shit. Yo, what is going? Okay, 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 okay. Get, get this shit out of here. Get this. We need, we need a key of prosperity. No, 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 no. We need any, any more. This one. That's good. Gladiolio. Man, screw whatever. We're sorely overmatched, knocked. Let us retreat. No, no, we're good. Isn't it a bit early to be taking a break, Potter? Back to work I go. Good blink. Good, good blind side. Good freaking attack there. Big Perry. Big Perry. We can do this. Gladio's not looking too good. Okay, I'm trying to get out. I'm trying to get out. This business is poor. Clean your glasses. Capital idea, knocked. If we wish to succeed, we need all be present. Man, we're dodging like the Matrix in this mother effer. Big Perry, let's go. Let's go, Gladio. Come on. Okay, Gladio's swinging. He's swinging. Knocked. Prompto's in trouble. Uh, let's use a Phoenix down. Do we have a Phoenix? We we just need to use a regular heal. Um, prompto, right? Got it. Okay, good job. Let's get out. Uh, let's go for you. You good. Holy shit, yo, we're getting ganked on, dude. Okay, I I completely misunderestimated these guys. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Nice work, Gladio. Gladio, do it. Let's go. Nice. Big damage. Yo, he hits me. Oh my god. Yo, we've been fighting these guys for a hot minute. I'm not gonna lie. These guys hurt really bad. Knocked. Back me up. Trying. Now, coming up. Good blindside link there. Very important. Let's get up here. We're out of mana. Let's go back in. There we go, big stuff there. Big blindside link. Okay, we're, we're doing things, we're doing things. Big parry. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, let me revive Gladiolio. He got owned, he got owned. Dude, we died like we we got down like I don't even know how many times, bro. Certainly, expect this much trouble. <sighs> Just keep it together, <laughs> Oh my God! They knocked me out of that. I'm afraid break time's over, buddy. I know. I know. I was a goner. <laughs> Okay, we got a little thing going on. One false move and we're done for. We can sound the tide yet. Blindside link against mi uh, um, air. 
I like that. We got you. Get his ass. <clears throat> Come on. Holy mamacita. Oh, it's not over. It's not over. Oh my goodness. Bro, we used so many potions there. Dude, did we did I level up? I need to we need to level up something, man. We got fucked on there. Leave a hologram. Wait, combat, teamwork. I need stats, bro. We need stats, bro. Yeah, yeah. Increase HP of each fire member twice the number of levels gained. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, I'm taking that. Oh my god, it's a lot of AP though. Oh no, it's not. Uh, equip two accessories. Yes, yes, yes. That's yeah. That's what was going on. I was like, dude, something's up with this fight. Like we are so weak compared to these guys. Why is it the same thing? Oh, it's for Ignis, this is for, or it's for Noctis, it's for Gladioli. Okay, it's for each individual person. Equip three slots, 332 AP, and no, I'll pass. Enhance the strength of AP, or enhance the strength Oh, these are all 99, eh? Uh, magic recovery. What's up with recovery, though? Increase the HP recovery while uh, after porn warping? Raise MP and uh, recovery while, uh, while downed. And not really the greatest. Let's go with techniques. Draw enemy attention across a wide area with a firearm. We don't have firearms yet. Add to the tech bar when Noctis lands in a... We'll just do that. I don't know what this means, but... Alright, hopefully this makes us better. Yo, that was a tough-ass fight, bro. That was a tough-ass fight. Let's go back to the tipster. Get our money, get our reward. Sleep. I need sleep. Been too long since we got a full night's rest. Time we put an end to that. Oh, what's this? House Florette goes high fashion. Lady Lunafreya's wedding dress designed by Vivian Westwood. A feature Isn't that a real wedding. designer in real life? Hello to Lady Lunafreya's dress. That's some fancy fabric work. That's some fancy fabric work. Oh my god, guys. That fight was so tough, man. Holy crap. Those guys just, like, weren't going down. And... The combat is a little bit wonky, especially when there's like five people attacking you. I don't really like that too much. But maybe they'll give you better options for like area of effect attacks, like AoE attacks. Because, man, it was not looking good earlier. We had zero crowd control, you know? We could not control the enemies. Welcome back. Okay, we did that. That one was a hard Making one. Making quite a name for yourself. High elixir? Dang, just only one high elixir? Okay. Alright, so what are we doing now? Oh, we, 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 did, we did another one? A fine show. I don't think we did another one, did we? Oh, they actually spawned at the same time? Whoa, fencer anklet. Alright, this thing better be good. We can now equip two accessories for Noctis as well. Allow me to take your order. So we should be able to, you know, get some buffs on the board. Crap, I'm always pressing the wrong key. So Noctis, yeah, here we go. Fencer's anklet, an anklet bearing the motif of an ancient fencer enhances vitality. Oh, we'll just go with it, whatever. So we gotta investigate the dock. Um, what we have that other quest, right? It's level 17 though. I will pass on that. Let's go ahead and just investigate the dog. Because we've already done a whole bunch of nothing, guys. Hopefully, maybe something pops up. In terms of storyline. The Hexatheon. Titan, the Archaeon. Steadfast as Stone. Ramu, the Fulgarian. Sharp as Lightning. Shiva, 
the Glacian, gentle as snow, Leviathan, the Hydraean, relentless as tides, Bahama, the Draconian, unbending as iron, Ifrit, uh, the Infernian, fickle as fire, since time immortal, they have watched over Eos. Okay, so these guys, Titan, Ramu, Shiva, Leviathan, Bahamut, Ifrit. I recognize this couple of names. I recognize Shiva, Bahamut, and Ifrit. But it looks like these guys have been watching over Eos. These guys are like the gods. Interesting. Interesting. What's this? Potato chips? I know, to see a... The Saluna Cascades are calling you. Oh, are they now? Oh, are they now? Careful All right, let's massage. do it. Oh, oh, massage, eh? I don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Let's see if we can actually get a massage from him. That'll be crazy. Galden Spa, relax your body, open your mind, and awaken your soul to a better you for both ladies and gentlemen. You look so right this way, please. Oh, we can actually do. We can actually can get a massage. It doesn't even cost anything. All right, yeah, massage me up. No ditty, no ditty. Oh. Come on, Noctis. That ain't nothing, bro. That ain't nothing. All right, so we just got a little massage. All right, let's go now investigate the dock because I'm tired. I'm tired of lead already. I'm already tired of lead. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. What's this? Uh, today's ferry service out of or today's indeed. ferry schedule out of service. Who's this? Uh, oh man, not a ship in sight. What gives? Yeah, I don't know. Da, 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 da. What's at the end of the road here? What's at the end of the road, Jack? Oh, we're just chilling. We just hang out by the. Oh, this is cool. I like this. Wow, you can actually move the camera too. You can probably leave when you want to. Yeah. Oh, what the? No, 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 no. Okay, what am I supposed to be doing here, though? Wait, what? There's no quest for us to do here? Wah! Wah! Angel Guard, mysterious island off the coast of Galden Quay, rumored to be the spot where the gods gathered. Some devotees used to offer prayers from the dock of the quay, but none ever set sail for the Umbral Isle to make their prayers in person. The island is regarded as second ground, a sacred ground, never to be tread upon. Not even the royal family is allowed access. A series of reefs surrounds Angel Guard, cutting through the oceanic currents and threatening to sink any ships that veer too close. While ferries and sh uh, fishing boats typically avoid the island, some true adventurers, uh, some true adventurous anglers, have been known to approach the Umbral Isle in hopes of landing a big haul. But those reckless souls rarely return. Yeah. Okay, what am I supposed to do now, though? Oh, that guy's chilling by the dock, eh? Oh, wait, was that what I'm supposed to talk to? Uh -huh. This little sketch guy over here in the corner? Let's see if that's who we're supposed to talk to. Alright, nope. I lied. Huh. So we just have to kill spark shares, but like I'm way too low level. I'm way too low level. It's like level 14, and we are what currently eight and nine. Our highest level is level nine. Yeah, I'll pass. I'll pass. My sources, oh, who's this? Oh, given strict orders not to let any vessels leave the docks of Altitia. Real shame if you were late to your own wedding, right, Prince Noctus? Name's Dino, by the way. Pleasure. What up, Dino? The Crown Prince of Lucis, bounty hunting in his fancy car. Surely you didn't think it'd go unnoticed. At least not by this reporter. Lucky for you, this reporter has integrity. If you want to remain incognito, I'll respect your wish. In exchange for a favor. Uh, 
no, no, we're staying our ground. I'm not, I'm not getting extorted by no dude who looks like someone from his fucking, the fucking judge from the fucking Hunger Games head out. I'm staying on my ground. I ain't scared of you. I don't owe you anything. Wait, we mustn't rub him the wrong way. Ignis earned XP for that? The sound of tacit agreement. Here. What's that? Wait, what, what, what are we giving him? Oh, he gave us a map? Mark where you need to go on your map. All you gotta do is find me some rough gemstones. Like this one. Man, we gotta go do find this and stuff. your ship will come in. Don't, and the papers will run you out of town. Capiche? Jeez. Alright, this guy's blackmailing. Okay, I thought we were extorting him, but it looks like he's extorting us. Alright, I'm gonna end the video because I'm drunk and... Uh, I just, I just feel like, anyway, I'm feeling like, I don't think I'm gonna do the drinking streams a lot, but, you know, cause I'm just be so drunk, and like, I'm trying to give you guys, like, a professional experience, but it's not really too professional, cause I'm fucking drunk, but, um, I'm just gonna end the video right here, guys, cause we're, we're out of here, but, if you guys are still watching, thank you guys so much, like, comment, subscribe, unfortunately, today's episode was a little bit dry, not really too much going on in lead, to be completely honest with you, I was a little disappointed, uh, I wish there was maybe a little bit more story, a little bit more dialogue, all that stuff. But uh, regardless of that, it still looks amazing, plays amazing, it feels cool, it's good. But it just feels like I'm just doing mundane tasks. Like, I feel like I'm not even progressing the story at all. So that's my only issue with the starting zone here. Um, it's okay, not the greatest, could use some work. Sorry if I'm, you know, going off on them too, by the way. But, um... It's all love, by the way. Um, but, yeah, guys. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are still watching, I appreciate you guys a bunch. Um, this video today, unfortunately, also is going to be a more boring video. Not really much going on. Um, next time, I'm not going to be drunk. Because, like, I'm trying to enjoy my drunkenness. But, like, I feel like I have to be too professional right now. So, next time, I, I probably won't get drunk. I'm not gonna get drunk that often, but unless I'm playing like something that's like easy to play. But um, I think that's it for me today. Tomorrow, you guys are gonna see another video. We're gonna complete the areas. Uh, we're gonna complete the quest in the Golden Quay. That that freaking fight that we had earlier was absolutely crazy. We got our shit rocked. Um, but yeah, next time, hopefully we'll get a little bit stronger. We'll farm some XP and we'll you know take them out smooth. But, um, thank you guys again for all watching. I appreciate you guys a bunch. If you guys drank with me, thank you guys for drinking. Cheers to you guys. Um, I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Uh, I'm drunk. I'm freaking about to take a... I'm about to fall asleep in the chair. But, um, thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys. Uh, I love you guys. And I'm out. Peace!